Evolution is what makes all living things adapt and survive in an ever-changing world. These changes are often helpful and have a specific use, but some of them are just downright weird. On that note, today we're going to be looking at 10 of the weirdest evolutions. Stay tuned for number 1 because this Polly definitely doesn't want a cracker. Number 10. The Hotsin. Let's start off this list with an animal that not only has one, but two weird evolutionary traits. Meet the Hotsin. The Hodzin is a bizarre, primitive relative to the cuckoo bird native to South American rainforests, which retained a relic from its distant reptilian past. You see, when one of these chicks hatch, it quickly becomes apparent that these birds have retained incredibly primitive traits, and it stems all the way back to birds' hypothesized theropod dinosaur origins. What primitive traits, you might ask? Well, these birds are born with a pair of hands, aside from their wings. Two hands armed with sharp claws extend from the bird's wing joints. These hands are used by the bird to climb the trees to safety. Not to be content with growing handy appendages, the Hotin also developed a highly sophisticated digestive system. The Hotin is the only bird in existence that can claim to be ruminant. What is that, you might ask? Well, to put it simply, it has a second stomach. It has evolved the same dieting system as cattle, feeding upon fermenting green plant material in its second stomach. Number 9. The Marine Iguana. Evolution is often seen as a series of steps forward, from primitive to advanced, or from ocean to land, and not the other way around. I'm sure Sky comes somewhere in that, actually. In the Devonian era, Earth was dominated by a diversity of marine reptiles, all of which disappeared. In more recent ages of the Earth, lizards of all shapes and sizes walk across the land. One species of lizard apparently didn't get the memo and has returned to the ocean. The marine iguana is a giant pink-colored lizard that swims under the waves of the Galapagos Islands of Ecuador. It is a herbivore, just like its terrestrial cousin, the green iguana, and feeds exclusively on seaweeds. It can be observed hauled out on ocean islets among the salt spray, where it may be mistaken for a seal. Did you know that Godzilla started out as one of these creatures before a nuclear accident mutated him into the lightning-spewing, kaiju-fighting, city-wrecking behemoth that he eventually became? Well, at least in the Godzilla 2000 movie. No, well, extra facts there. You're welcome. Number 8. The Guilemont. Bird eggshells don't just protect the developing embryo inside, but also contain tiny pores to allow oxygen to pass through. Getting the pores clogged with gunk and grime could be a serious hazard and can even cause death to the growing chick. This is a particular danger for guillemots because they live in huge colonies of as many as 400,000 pairs and lay their eggs on bare cliff ledges. Also, these ledges become covered in substantial amounts of guano, and that's bird poop for those not in the know. To overcome this somewhat extreme environment and to prevent the eggshell pores from getting clogged with muck, guillemot eggs have evolved an ingenious solution. The outside of the eggshell is covered in tiny nanoscale cones. These cones work to make the eggshell surface hydrophobic, meaning they repel water. Water droplets form a perfect sphere on the surface rather than spreading and running down the shell. This structure is very similar to that found on lotus leaves and serves a self-cleaning function. This ensures the correct amount of gases are exchanged across the eggshell and helps the embryo develop successfully. Number 7. The Naked Mole Rat. Naked mole rats are definitely bizarre. They have evolved traits that even other animals will find weird. Seemingly immune to cancer and aging, they have a life expectancy of over 30 years, an insect-like social society dominated by a queen, and the uncanny ability of being able to run backwards as fast as they can run forwards. These features are thought to have evolved to help the animals survive in the hot, humid underground burrows with sparsely distributed food where they live in West Africa. You also may have seen them in the Fallout series, as well as Kim Possible. One interesting feature that doesn't get as much attention is their curious teeth, which they use to dig with. Their lower incisors are permanently on show on the outside of the animal's lips and can move independently of each other. Honestly, they're almost like a pair of chopsticks. This means that mole rats can dig with their teeth without getting too much soil in their mouths. Amazingly, naked mole rats have also been seen inserting the husks of tubers behind their incisors, placing them delicately in front of their lips to act as a face mask against the dirt. Number 6. The Climbing Catfish Now, we've all heard of flying fish and fish that can walk on land, but did you know that there is a fish that evolved the ability to climb on rocks? In the Orinoco River Valley in Venezuela, you can find these fish merrily walking up the rocks that fringe the river. These fish are a new species of catfish that hadn't previously been described. From above, the catfish's typical appearance hides an extraordinary secret. 
Underneath is a giant sucker and an extra pair of fleshy pelvic fins. Together, these two structures allow the catfish to climb up rock faces and out of the water because of the specialized pelvic fins that are able to move backwards and forwards independently. Climbing is presumably such an advantage for these fish because water levels in the small tributaries are so variable. Their fins allow them to move off in search of other water sources should levels drop too far, and during heavy rain, the fish temporarily can escape from the intense flow. Number 5. The Secretary Bird The Latin name for the secretary bird roughly translates as snake archer, which gives us a clue to the bird's diet. But hunting for venomous snakes comes with risks. If a bird were to mistime an attack, it could get bitten, with serious consequences. This unusual predator-predator relationship has led to the secretary bird to evolve faster attack and response times, but also has one of the strongest kicks in the animal kingdom. They can kick and stamp on their prey's head until it is killed or incapacitated, but the first kick is particularly important because it stuns the prey before it has a chance to retaliate. From a standing position, secretary birds can kick with as much force as five to six times their own body weight. This is the equivalent of a grown man kicking with 400 kilograms of force. Even more impressively, secretary birds deliver this huge force in a ridiculously short time. The foot is in contact with the snake for just 15 milliseconds. To put this in context, it takes you 150 to 300 milliseconds to blink your eye. Number 4. The Eye 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 Eyes may look like Gollum, but they're not from the Lord of the Rings Middle Earth. They are actually from a region of Earth known as Madagascar, a place where some of the strangest creatures have evolved. Although they may not look like it, eye eyes are primates, which means they are related to humans, chimpanzees, and monkeys, but are only one foot tall. Eye eyes and chimps share something in common. They both love to feed on termites and wood boring insects. However, where chimpanzees learn to use a stick to reach the insects, the eye eye's middle finger has evolved to an incredible length, allowing it to reach for the bugs unassisted by tools. Another amazing evolutionary trait of the eye eye is that it is the only primate that can use echolocation. While foraging for the insects they love to eat, they tap the trunk or branch of a tree, listening to the echo produced by the tapping sound. Based on this, they can tell if the inside of the wood is hollow, and if it is, it likely contains insect larvae for them to eat. This unique method of finding food is known as percussive foraging, and the only other animal to use this is the striped possum. Number 3. The Palm Nut Vulture We've actually talked about this one on a previous list. When you hear the word vulture, what immediately comes to your mind? Huge, grotesque, and stinky birds always on the lookout for rotting carcasses of animals or humans to feast upon. Well, the palm nut vulture is definitely not that kind of vulture. In fact, it's actually mostly a vegetarian, aside from some fish. The palm nut vulture is an African relative of the golden eagle, buzzard, and goshawk. But unlike its flesh-loving relatives, these birds set their sights on a different kind of prey. One that doesn't fight back. These birds ferociously attack oil palm trees, feeding on its juicy palm nuts. This raptor has a specially adapted digestive system, but looks and acts just like most other eagles in every way. The massive bill cracks open the nuts and extracts the fatty insides, which provide a viable substitute for the animal's typical meat diet. This bird shows how fluid genetic adaptation is and how quickly an animal can deviate from the norm. Now it's time for the day's best pick. And today we're going to be looking at an animal that evolved into the way it currently looks, probably because it likes to lie in bed all day, which should be a warning to all those lazy slobs out there. Number 2. The Flatfish Flatfish are called flatfish because, well, they're flat. They evolved their, um, flatness when their ancestors decided that swimming in the open ocean is just too much work for them, opting to lie down flat on the sea floor instead. There are several different kinds of flatfish. Some of them are fished commercially, like flounders, sole, turbot, place, and halibut. They are, however, aren't born flat as a pancake. They start out their life fully symmetrical, like any other fish, but undergo a spectacular metamorphosis where the symmetrical larva is transformed into an asymmetric juvenile whose eyes end up on one side of the head. Some species have both eyes on the left like the turbot, some on the right like the halibut and the sole, but what all living and most fossil flatfish have in common is that they always have an eyed side and a blind side. As they move from open water to live and feed on the seabed, a second change occurs. The flatfish's downward facing side loses its skin pigment. The puzzle of how these changes could occur in the course of evolution has been intriguing scientists for a long time. Even Darwin was at a loss to explain the remarkable peculiarity of flatfish anatomy. I saved the best for last, but first, I have a quick challenge that takes only 5 seconds to complete. If you can leave a like and subscribe,
subscribe within the next five seconds, you'll get 10 years of amazing luck. Just try it, it really works. Number one, the Kia. We've also talked about this one before too. Parrots are known as colorful, friendly, tropical birds with a penchant for tree nuts and also crackers and probably saying some stuff to you. Many are favored as pets and are stereotyped as the companions of pirates. However, the New Zealand mountain parrot known as a Kia takes rebellion against the norm to the extreme. Weighing well over two pounds with a four-foot wingspan, Kia are carnivorous parrots with a penchant for eating birds, small mammals, and occasionally, uh, sheep. In fact, they've been filmed ripping sheep open at night and feeding on the fat and mutton, often with fatal results. They are quite mischievous as well. They're capable of removing headlights from parked cars and shattering windows. Unlike any other parrot, Kia live in mountain passes and may be seen in the snow. The harsh environment has made them the most intelligent parrot species and possibly the smartest bird on the planet. These birds soar like hawks when searching for their prey and vocalize like a hawk, not a parrot. Unfortunately, these amazing birds have become endangered due to human interference. Which weird evolutionary trait would you like to have yourself? Let us know in the comments section below. Want to watch more videos about weird and amazing animals? Click on any of the videos you see on your screen. As always, everybody, thank you all for watching, and I will see you all next time. Later, everybody.